discretion is advised. Hey everyone, welcome back to Board Games Unlocked, and today I'm doing a no run through review for Alien Artifacts Discovery, this tiny little expansion pack for Alien Artifacts. Now, I'll just set this right here. The, the deck is no longer in it. Um, so, uh, this is the expansion for Alien Artifacts, which this could be a very small, uh, small review over this because it doesn't really add a whole lot. Uh, the, the expansion basically adds a few more cards to the planets, to the technologies, and to the ships, which have a new kind of keyword on them that basically whenever you, well, the planets do anyway, um, and uh, it basically just adds a new deck, like a new resource deck, which, I mean, I thought was actually pretty nice. Like, when my initial uh, thoughts on Alien Artifacts was... I was told this is a 4x game that in an hour. I'm like, okay, so uh, that's gonna fail. And surprisingly, no, it didn't. It does kind of feel like a 4x game. Um, well, more or less, besides the kind of exterminate part, but it has everything else. Um, and it's it's a very solid game. You can I've actually done a run through and a discussion for Alien Artifacts. So if you want to go check that out, the Link is in the eye here or here. It's somewhere. Like just click the eye and then and then you'll you can take it to it. But uh, I did feel like it needed a little bit more, like a little bit more variety, maybe a little bit more of that extermination, a little bit more aggressiveness. So uh, they did discovery, and essentially all it does is it has a deck that whenever you, for example, get a planet that uh, has that um, has that keyword and I cannot remember the keyword directly off the top of my head but it allows you to either you can regularly put resources on there or you can take two cards from this discovery deck and those have ability well not abilities but kind of like effects so some of them are like okay if you draw this gain a victory point it's like all right cool and or if you draw this uh, take another production card like or take another one and so it just adds some variety within this deck to kind of make you want to expand into more you know planets and resources to to be able to get these these uh unique effects that, that are actually pretty beneficial because it allows you to do more on your turn than just like the one action um so I very much like that deck, and the it doesn't give well it doesn't give you a bunch of resources. So your planet doesn't like have a bunch of stuff that can help you build technologies or or ships. Uh, they they are wilds, so that is very nice. I think the most is there were like two, like two wilds on there, but I, that may even be incorrect. You can probably just I think that if if they were just one. Um, but you have like three of them, or at least two of them, so it's like, okay, great, I have some wilds, I got these benefits. So you have to outweigh, like, you have to think, okay, do I want resources that don't come out of my hand that I can just move over from these planets and help me that way, or do I want these effects as well as just a wild? So you kind of have to think about like that. Uh, they also added these technologies that, um, like, essentially worked around kind of not being so aggressive with a lot of your ships or a lot of your technologies. So that was pretty pretty neat. And then the ships were instead of like attacking, you could you can get like points off of that. Um but I mean that's pretty much it. Like I was I was very surprised that the the expansion was this tiny little this tiny little deck. Um if they continue to support the game then I think I think this is probably the route to go with that kind of game. Like it doesn't need this grandiose board. It just needs more variety, more unique decks instead of just because I mean more to the planets, uh, ships, and technologies are nice. But I like the fact that the focal point wasn't just that. It wasn't just hey, here's a deck of cards. Three fourths of it or uh, one third of it is planets. One third of it is technology. And one third of it is ships. That would have been kind of lame, but they did throw in some more, and then some more alien artifacts, which is always nice, because those are really good to have. And then, but they had a separate deck that kind of gave, gave you some more, but it wasn't like, oh god, how do we learn this again? No, it was very simple to just throw in. I will not be playing alien artifacts without the discovery expansion, so that's also really good, because it's just easy to put in. It's easy to teach people. 
It's like, hey, you know, if you want this planet, you can choose those instead. Well, depending on, you know, the planet that you get. So, uh, on a scale of 1 to 10, for, for Alien Artifacts Discovery, I'm going to give it a, hmm, I'm going to give it a 7. I think that is a, a very solid, for a small expansion, I'm not going to give it like a 9. It wasn't like groundbreaking for, for the game. Um, probably, I think it is an expansion that is, I wouldn't say it's a must, uh, like, I wouldn't say, okay, like, if, you, if you're going to play Alien Artifacts, you have to get that expansion. No, no. It doesn't do that much for the game. But if you like Alien Artifacts and, you're, and you want a little, bit, a little bit more, a little more to wet your whistle, then uh, Discoveries, I think, will, will potentially do that for you. So uh, that's my thoughts on Alien Artifacts. Let me, know, <laughs> let me know what you think of this expansion and, I mean, Alien Artifacts as well in the comments below. Other than that, like, comment, share, and subscribe, and have a wonderful whatever time of day it is for you. Hey everyone, thanks so much for watching this, and if you like this video, then click the subscribe button below to enjoy any video that I put out. And right next to that subscribe button is a little bell, click that so you get notified of whenever I actually upload these videos. If you want to support the channel, you can definitely visit my Patreon page, the link is in the description below. Other than that, like, comment, share, and subscribe, and have a wonderful whatever time of day it is for you.